thing is I tell people, a dance gotta grow. Like dance, the lock-in style can't look like the 70s and 2000s. Because everything has changed, music has changed. But I always tell people, you still gotta keep the foundation into what you do after it. I always tell people like me, I wasn't back in the 70s. I went back in the 80s. I came in the 90s and 2000s as far as locking. And if you look at my locking, I'm adding breaking to my locking. I'm adding house to my locking. But what do I always do in my locking? I go back to the lock. I might lock, bop, bop, then do six steps, bop, bop, then right back to the lock. That's how you make the dance better. That's how you add stuff, is you just make sure you keep the foundation. Now the problem with a lot of the old school cats, they ass can't do it, so they start complaining about it and telling people that's wrong because they can't do it. When they need to start eating right, start stretching right, and start getting their bodies so their body can start doing what the new generation is doing. Because I tell people, without the old generation, it wouldn't be the new generation. If without, if without the new generation, it wouldn't be the old generation bringing, bringing them up. We gotta respect each other, we need to stop. And it makes me upset when I hear people say, that's wrong, you're doing that wrong, that ain't right. The only thing, if you're popping, you got pop. If you lock, you lock. Whatever you add in there, that's your own identity. That's how you become your own individual. So that's my take on that.